Today's Better Living Now is brought to you by Zare Center for Orthopedics. Over one million joint replacements were performed last year. Who is getting all of these joint replacements? Surprisingly, a lot of younger people are getting hip and knee replacements. In the United States, currently half of the joint replacements are being put in people under the age of 65. It's just not for grandma and grandpa anymore. We're seeing 40 and 50 year old people decide that they don't want to live with the agonizing pain of an arthritic knee or hip and they don't want to wait 10 or 15 years to get this done. They want to proceed, get their knees fixed, have no pain, get back to the activities of their normal life. Is joint replacement a real solution for the younger patient? Currently, there's not a biological cure for an arthritic joint. So the natural progression of deteriorating joints is to achieve a bone-on-bone -bone status. We've learned quite a bit on how to preserve these joints and make them last a long time. Typically, 90% of the joint replacements that go in are lasting 20 years. Younger people tend to be more abusive on their joints, will start running and playing hard sports, and those may wear out a little more quickly, but our alternative is for them to continue in an agonizing state with medications that aren't helping them. So yes, in fact, joint replacement is a very good alternative to what the natural history would provide for them.